Hello everybody. I was trying to film this intro from my bedroom balcony here at my new house in Kento, Vietnam. However, it's raining so hard outside that, that the audio was not picking up at all, so I had to move it indoors. Oh, and by the way, if you do want a tour of the house, uh, let me know in the comments below. I'm sure I can arrange something. And as a little um, preview, I'll show you some footage I took from the balcony so you can see my beautiful view. Anyway, from the time I left my Indiana home to the time I arrived at my new house here in Vietnam, it was 117 days. It was one hell of an adventure, and some would say the world's longest vacation, However, I do have to admit, it's nice to settle down and put my feet up for a while. I already showed you my Iowa IndyCar experience and the week I got to spend in beautiful Northern California. But when we last left off, I had just arrived in Thailand and cut off my ridiculously long hair. Now, let's go back to the three weeks I spent in Thailand. And when we're done looking at that, I will be back with some closing comments. Hello everybody. It was the first three weeks of August and I was so happy to be back in Thailand. Finally could have some beautiful places to dive. It's refreshing after being restricted to training dives in southern Illinois. If you see some plastic in the ocean, please do us all a favor and pull it out. I'm sure it's just a drop in the bucket, but every little bit helps. Later that week I can confirm on Walking Street I was attacked by a giant crab. But the night wasn't a total failure. Got to see some great entertainment. While in Pattaya, I wanted to check out Route 66. Old school, classic American diner. Saw this place featured on many of the YouTube channels that I followed over the years, so I wanted to go check it out. I'm not sure if there's any connection with Indiana, but there was a considerable amount of Indiana license plates hung on the wall, so... I don't know. I never got to meet the owner, so I'm not quite sure. During almost the entire three weeks in Thailand, we had pretty good weather. The rain stayed away for the most part, and we had many, many bright, sunny days. I'm very thankful. was at Terminal 21, a huge mall. I saw this Fairtex logo across the street, so I took that picture for all of my Muay Thai friends back home. Also, as you can see in this photo, I may have overpacked for this journey. Then it was off to Hua Hin to spend the afternoon with some beautiful local people and wake up bright and early the next morning to see an insanely beautiful sunrise. Then it was off to Prachuap Kirikan to meet some new friends, both the two-legged and the four-legged variety. 
The most interesting part about traveling is all the interesting new people you meet. Sometimes it's just in passing, but sometimes they become lifelong friends. And before leaving Thailand, I had to buy this classy new laptop bag. Then it was time to leave and head to Australia. And before we go, I have got to take some time to say thanks to the following people from the following YouTube channels. Nick, Martin, and Dan Dan the Cameraman from NDTBI Thailand. James and Fa from Chocolate Man in Thailand, Lucas from Rides for Kicks, Carl from Carl's Thailand, and Brian from Greeny Travels. But I cannot say thank you enough to Gift and Foreigner Joe from the Thai Girl Gift and Foreigner Joe channel. I've talked to all of these people in person, some more than others, but they all, either in person or through their channel, have reaffirmed my decision to pack up and move to Southeast Asia. Thank you guys so much. To everybody else out there, the world is a huge place. You don't have enough time to see the whole thing, but 
go out and see some of it. See as much as you can before your body assumes room temperature. I'll see you next time. And here, it's raining really bad and I'm just gonna have to yell. Three, two, one, go. Here in my new home here. Here, here, one more time here. Three, two, one. From the time I left my Indiana home to the time I arrived at my new house here in Indiana, boom, that doesn't work that way. It was. So you could see my amazing view. Oh my God, it's so beautiful. Sarcasm. Why do I keep <laughs> that up?